Got it. 짱 예쁘다. 같이 놀래? 예쁜 애가 좋아. Got it. 짱 계속 마셔. 쉽게 뿌리. Oh yeah, 뿌리 뿌리. I'm gonna rip you apart. I want to apologize.
thing? 1.0? This one is about the same thickness as a regular number two pencil. This one is kind of the middle ground where it's not too dark but not very light either. And this is the lightest one I have, which I like to use for sketching. I do a lot of my shading with this dried out, um, gray zebra midliner marker. Cause, pro tip, it's actually pretty good to try and shade with the dried out markers. It gives a nice texture. So yeah, you don't have to buy expensive art supplies to be good at art. You can just use anything you find at a dollar store. These are two doodles I did of 2D in my art class, and I just did it with this pencil I bought from the Dollar General. You can make art with anything, even if you don't have that much money. Thanks for watching. See ya. Hey guys, it's time for another sketchbook tour. A lot of stuff in here is pretty experimental. I was trying out some new things and also experimenting with my art style, so let's check it out. Last time that I did a video showing my sketchbook, people wanted a little close up of my Emmett keychain, so here he is. And on the cover, I have some John Doe stickers. This like glows under UV light, but I don't have black lights in my room, sadly. And this is like a little dough ball sticker it is like glitter. I, lo I love glitter. Before I open this, I do need to say that the first page has like some blood and stitching. So if you don't like that, maybe skip forward a little bit. All right, here's the first page. I'm kind of trying out a new coloring style. And so far, I really like how this looks. I really like the shading on the hair. But yeah, this is uh, me as a zombie because I don't know, like I love zombies. And I've been doing the dates on the back of the drawings now. This was on February 1st. Over here, we got Carl from La Talos because... Thanks TikTok Mutuals for getting me into this. I really like how this turned out. This is one of my favorite poses that he does and I wanted to try drawing it. I I love the background so much. This was this was really fun to do. And here's the date with a doodle of Carl and I tried doing Arma, but that just looks like a duck. And over here is a drawing I did of myself. This is honestly one of my favorite drawings I did so far. I used like this kind of shiny pen to do the music notes and I, I really love how this page came together. Here's a day with a little alien doodle. And over here is a drawing of my OC Keith. I love drawing him and I'm so glad that a lot of people like him too. Here's the date and here's a drawing of my other OC Spike who is Keith's best friend. Just so you guys know, I read the comments and I see what you say about him. Here's the date with a little doodle Spike and here's a drawing of Jushimatsu from Osumatsu-san because every time I think I forgot about it, I end up drawing him again. He's my favorite though, he's so goofy. Here's the date with a little doodle. Here's my dog trap drawing I did. I cut off the bottom half because I was embarrassed that I spelled darkest desire wrong. Here are some eye doodles I did. You can probably tell that I used to draw Bill Cypher a lot. There's the day with a little doodle. This is a drawing of Carl I did while watching the Super Bowl. I was trying to convert him more to my art style because the other drawing was just me referencing the screenshot. I know his hair's on the wrong side, but I was too far in to change it. Here's the day with a little drawing of Carl again. This man is deranged. And here's another drawing of Keith I did while watching the Super Bowl. I like having my characters have like their own color of blood. I gave Keith like dark blue kind of blood. The background's nice and lately I've been trying to practice more sitting poses because that's what I struggle with the most and I'm trying to get better at it. Here's the date with a little doodle of Keith. And that's kind of all I have right now. 